Hey guys, this is Jacqueline Jacks, and I love AVA Live Radio. This is Lainey Nash, and I love AVA. Welcome to AVA Live Radio, Kevin. Hey, thank you, Jacqueline. This is a thrill and an honor to be here with you. Well, it's a thrill and an honor to have you, sir. Thank you very <laughs> <Okay>. much. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> cool. Uh, I love I love your song. It's one of my favorites. It really is. I uh I, you know, I think it started with that riff, you know, at the beginning of the song I was just playing the guitar, you know, just messing around with that riff and um I always wanted to write a song about my time out in New York City when I first met my wife and it was just such an amazing time, just so carefree and just having a blast. So the it all just kind of came together and um you know, pretty much wrote it all in in about one night and then kind of developed it a little bit over the next few days and put together a rough demo and um kind of a long story short met up with uh, a producer out in los angeles he uh, recorded all the tracks i flew out there and did the vocals and uh and there you have it it's interesting to me do you feel that since you released a taste of heaven you've had a lot of really exciting things happen to you oh i have yeah it's been great um even from the get-go you get you know getting radio play around yeah. you know the u.s and europe and um uh it was nominated for uh, the hollywood music awards best alternative song um for 2014 um i made a video um and that's basically been shown on nbc comcast throughout the country and over in europe so uh, yeah a lot of cool things yeah Congratulations on the nomination too. I'm very excited for you. That must have. Oh, been. But when you get nominated for something like this, do you see a lot of social media activity as a result of it? Oh yeah, uh, yeah. Hollywood Music Awards is a real cool event. Uh, very prestigious. Uh, people from around the world fly into it. Um, so yeah, there's you know I definitely jumped on that and used that to really promote the the song and and uh, it just gives you a bit of credibility, I think. Absolutely, yeah. It must feel great. It must make you feel very, yeah. you know, like encouraged and just, yeah, i got to keep going with this, right? Where a lot of people, it is. as yeah. they go through their music journey, they just don't really know how to judge it. But unless, unless a radio station, you know, jumps on board, that's for sure. Yeah, because, you know, that's the funny thing. You finish a song and, of course, you know, as an artist, you, you think it's great. And, of course, your family and friends think it's great. But, when you put it out there in the industry, you know, that's where you got to just kind of hang tight and hear what they have to say because they're going to be honest. And, you know, if they think it tanks, you know, but if they really love it and give it a nomination, then it's like, oh, man, this is wild. It's it's just exciting. Yeah, so exciting. It must be. So you're calling to in, in from Minnesota right now? Yep, St. Saint, Saint Paul, Minnesota, yep. Do you play around a lot there, or are you doing everything, you focusing on your Internet, or what's happening with you? Yeah, I um, um, have been playing. I got a band together last fall and, um, you know, went through <clears throat> some personnel changes, but we, we got it down to a really amazing bunch of guys. Uh, there's four of us, myself included, and we've been playing the clubs here since January in uh, Minneapolis, St. Paul area, and, and down in Rochester, uh, not too far from here. So, uh, yeah, we've been having a blast playing the clubs, and it's been going over really good. What kind of energy are you getting from the fans? Yeah, real good energy. Um, you know, people, um, it was so funny. We were at a show, doing a show, and some guy um, uh, asked my wife, you know, what song is this? You know, and I got to have this. And he, he went on <laughs> iTunes right at that moment with his iPhone and downloaded it, and he was listening to that song instead of listening to us perform. <laughs> He does say when you when you perform that well on stage that you actually motivate somebody to go and download your song. You know you're doing something right. <laughs> yeah, I know. It, it was so cool. Um, and then we uh, we were part of that Hard Rock Rising uh, competition, and we made it through the first uh, screening and, and played the Hard Rock Cafe here at the Mall of America. And uh, that went over really good. i 
fears away 